All right, today is the day. We're going to jump in, take a look at the status of the Air Cape project, and then come back for a real quick discussion today. As you can see, the entire plug has molds taken off of it. It is time to get the plug out of here and start building the car itself. The only thing left actually is the bracing. You see the bracing there on the doors. I need to put bracing on the tub section and one across the back end. But otherwise, it is ready to disassemble all the molds, get the plug out of here. That is our goal, to be ready by the beginning of the year to assemble the car rather than be working on individual components. Okay, so we're back. And I want to make a real quick video just discussing what's going to be coming up in this next year. Um, as you see, the car is kind of at a point where there's going to be kind of a shift in the way things are going. From the point that we have been working on building the molds and components to now the plug is going to be going out of here and we're going to be actually start to assembling the car. And as that goes on, I also want to kind of uh, change or shift a little bit in the way the videos go. And I'm hoping to get your input in how this goes. Um, so hopefully maybe you make some comments below that tell me what you think. But here's some ideas that I've been thinking about and how maybe you can help me to adjust this. I always do the videos with an introduction and a closing. So from now, I'm gonna just keep doing that unless you have some suggestions otherwise. Do I take too much time in those introductions? You wanna see just getting right to the work or how that goes. Anyway, like I said, let me know what you think about that. I know I've also had some comments about the audio quality. And I've looked into that and I think the audio quality is not the equipment. I think it's me, that I slur my words and get rattling on too much. And that's for two things. One, when you put a video camera in front of you, it just kind of shuts your brain off a little bit. And that will get better over time. So I'm told, but I'm sure it will. It's gotten better already, but I will try to enunciate better and correct that. That's the only thing that's going to fix that is me rather than any better equipment. Um, the only other problem is another one that I can't fix is recording audio in the shop where you've got hard surfaces everywhere. There's way too much echo, even with the lapel microphone. I pick up too much ambient sound ricochets anyway. So audio is one thing that we're going to try to adjust, at least from my side. Um, the other thing is, I have done some other videos besides that of the air tape project. Um, probably one of those that have been a little more viewed is I did some architectural spires, made a mold, and then some urethane parts off of that. Um, are people really interested in that? They don't seem to get very many views compared to the air tape project. Should I just dump them off of the side and not do that in this channel? Or are those interesting in themselves? Another thing is the pace of the videos. I try to keep my videos very short because I do follow a format of what I like to go see and I don't like things strung out and stretched out way too long. So as an example, the last video was about 20 minutes long. That was the wiring harness. Is that too long? Is that going in depth enough? Most videos, five to eight minutes, are those too short? You feel cheated, you want a little more in-depth example or a little more in-depth uh, dive into what's going on. Anyway, be interested to know that as well. I'm hoping what happens with this video channel is that I can use it as a source to connect with lots of people and be able to use the comment section to help each other out, find out what they're doing, show them what I'm doing, and enlarge the circle of people doing this type of thing and using that as a sphere of influence, not amongst myself, but amongst all of those watching the channel. And uh, I know this is a pipe dream, hoping to evade all the little snarky comments and people trying to aggrandize themselves by showing what wonderful things they know. Anyway, that is our plan for this coming year and hope you uh, are going to follow along with us and be part of that. Anyway, thanks for coming along today and we'll see you next time.